Just what is mainland China's new economic growth model? Well, a panel on day one of the Asian Financial Forum 2014 in Hong Kong attempted to unravel that question, starting with a look at the opportunities presented by mainland China's attempts to open its domestic market. If China is going to reform, carry on this uh, change, that uh, the, these uh, government hands need to be softened, more smart. Let the, as the, the forum decided, let the market play the decisive role in, in placing the resources. Let the SOEs be more liberal and become a hybrided and become more vibrant, open more services, open more areas for the private investment to participate. Of course, also open for the international investment. The strategic goal of such a free trade zone is to open up Shanghai as a gateway for international investment and also to facilitate investment from both overseas and from domestic uh, investors and to liberalize the trade and financial market in Shanghai. Some people have been querying as to whether because of the Shanghai Free Trade Zone some financial services and resources in Hong Kong will be poached by Shanghai. But I don't think that is the right way to look at it. With financial reform in Shanghai, it would only mean that there will be more resources and more opportunities being offered up and being generated for the benefit of both Hong Kong and Shanghai. Shanghai, uh, uh, the free trade zone, uh, like have the, uh, uh, is a systematic uh, experimentation. Um, just as uh, Deputy Mayor has uh, described, that there's uh, um, many aspects that need to be thought of and built of. But I believe um, we need further um, systematic design, even the bigger system, the economy. First, uh, I, I still believe that uh, we need to get the economy right and before we get uh, you know, the finance right. The increasing use of technology should help push it uh, to the next level of growth. Another one is urbanization is still uh, continuing. It's still 12, 15 million people coming into, the, into town. Number three, I think the Chinese economy is, is extraordinarily irrational in many areas. There are many, many areas that really doesn't make sense. And all you need to do is to make it make sense. Use common sense and make it make sense. I think that in itself uh, can improve efficiency uh, and create many, many business opportunity. I believe that China has a good chance, provided that the reform will continue uh, successfully, that China should be able to easily, in my opinion, go, uh, go beyond the middle uh, income trap.